Hey guys, welcome back to Vanguard Motor Sales. I'm Greg and this is a 69 Roadrunner. It is black and it is beautiful. That 383 is backed up with a four speed. That 383 also has got some aluminum heads on it. This thing drives amazing. We were just out driving it around the block. It is, sounds great, it shifts great, stops great, goes great. I mean, she's black and beautiful, ready to park this dream in your driveway. So give Tom a call anytime at 248-974-9513. Look down the side of that car. I'll tell you what, the body man on this thing hit it out of the park, straight as an arrow. The guy that pulled the trigger on the paint also laid it down slick as can be. The car is beautiful. Then it's got black interior. Everybody knows I love some black interior in a muscle car. Look at that steering wheel. That steering wheel looks like brand new 1969. That baby's beautiful. I believe those cost about a thousand dollars if I remember right. It's got the uh, Hurst uh, pistol grip shifter. She's hiding in there. We got great looking carpeting. We got great looking upholstery. Just everything about this car is just beautiful guys and it's been on the rotisserie. So the bottom side of this car is just as shiny as the top side. Tell you what, you are gonna be the envy of your entire neighborhood, your entire town, every car show you go to. This is one amazing car right here, guys. Dash is looking sweet. And then look at these door gems here. Look where that skin's folded over. Look how nice that line is. Look how nice and clean everything is. Just beautiful. Now, as you look down the side of the car, that big old long quarter panel, again, straight as can be. The stance on the car is killer too. Man, we got about, the back end's about two, two and a half inches up from the front. The chrome on the back bumper looks like it's new. That exhaust, you're gonna see that in a little bit. I've already done the underside video too. It's three inch all the way up. You can see the trims on these taillights. These are always something you need to look at on every Roadrunner. They look like they're brand new. And there's my little buddy, the Roadrunner, right there. I used to watch those cartoons, man. He always kicked the coyote's butt. Look at that trunk floor. Now you also need to pull the mat up on every car, especially Roadrunners. See how this is all nicely painted and that trunk pan looks nice. Look down in these areas. Again, that's where the water would run in on these things. Then you can see the bottom side of the deck lids nicely painted. She's just a beauty. Now look down that passenger side. Look at the stance on this thing, man. This thing looks fast sitting still. She's a beauty. So we're gonna get it up on the lift so you can check out the bottom side. We're going to do an inspection on the entire car so you can call Tom anytime and Tom can tell you all about the car. He answers his phone seven days a week. Now, if you want to see about a hundred pictures of the car, go into the description there in YouTube and there's a link to our website. You can click that link, it'll take you directly to our website. You can see pictures of this car and the rest of our inventory. And make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel hit the little bell button so every time we get a cool car like this one in, you get a notification. is Black Roadrunner for a ride. She is black and beautiful and a 69. Got that hopped up 383 up front with those aluminum heads, the four speed, the pistol grip shifter. I 
tell you, this thing is a dream. Everybody's dreaming about a Black Roadrunner all the way back to 1969. Actually, uh, I got Hawk Hogan calling us on Black Roadrunners. I guess his very first car in high school was a Black Roadrunner, four speed. That's some cool stuff right there. Now we can deliver this car anywhere in the world. You just give us a call at 248-974-9513. Tom will take you through the whole process, just how easy it is to park this dream in your driveway. We can help you out with financing too. You can call him anytime. He answers his phone seven days a week. So pick up the phone and give him a call. He'll tell you all about this car and just how easy it is to park this dream in your drive. As you can see down here on the dash, I mean, it looks brand new. Everything looks sweet. Looks like everything's working. The tack's working, the speedo's working. Actually, it's got a remote tack. The uh, tack in the dash is not working. It's got an aftermarket radio in it. We got oil pressure gauge down here. Very cool, guys, and she's black. She's been on the rotisserie. It's just as nice on the bottom as it is on the top. So if you'd like to come in and visit, we'd love to have you. We're right outside of Detroit, close to the airport. So if you need to fly in, no problem. If you need to spend the night, there's a hotel right at the airport. A lot of people can fly in in the morning and fly right back out that afternoon. Also, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit that little bell button so that we can send you a notification every time we get something new in. Now we're gonna put this baby up in the air so you can see the bottom like we do every car in our inventory here at Vanguard. We're gonna do that for you right now. All right, we're underneath this Roadrunner now, and man, she is pretty under hair. Look at that brand new tank, brand new three inch exhaust. Of course, it's got duals. There's a great big old chrome cover on this Dana rear end, 355 gear, and it is sure grip. We're gonna stick some of that Mickey Thompson to the road. Looks like it's got brand new parking brake cables. Looks like brand new stainless lines for the brakes. And the guys will pull those brakes all apart, make sure they're in good working order. You can see brand new U-bolts here. I can see that the uh, cylinder here and the brakes is new, so we got some new hardware there. Um, Flowmaster mufflers, they got real nice hangers here. They look like uh, they look like upgraded stock hangers. Now they've painted the drive shaft the bare metal color, which is very cool. And you can see that the floorboards are all nicely painted black, looking sweet. Now on all these Mopars, you need to take a look at this lower area in the frame. So if you're buying one of these Mopars, because these things would fill up with dirt and stuff, so this is a spot that you want to look at on every car. You can see that this one is beautiful. Now we got brand new fuel line going front to back. We got brand new brake line going front to back. We got a uh, X pipe here in the exhaust. And then this cross member is really important too, because this is where the torsion bars hook in. So you want to make sure you take a look at this cross member. Make sure this cross member is in good shape. And then of course the low area and this front frame also. You can see everything under here is just neat as can be. We got the Mopar four speed trans here. These headers look like they are um, polished stainless steel. They're looking sweet. It's got an extra big capacity um, oil pan on it here. You can see the cane members in good shape, all painted up. You can also see it's got disc brakes and brand new flex lines going to those disc brakes. I see brand new bushings in the sway bar. I mean, everything under here. You may just have to buy some mirrors and show off the bottom side of this car. We got aluminum radiator here. I see aluminum pulleys there also. I see, uh, bring that light over here a little bit. Yeah, it's got an MSD balancer on it, so that's aftermarket. I see aluminum water pump. I see some aftermarket aluminum heads up there. We'll take a closer look at that here in a minute. Looks like brand new tires. These things are uh, on the skinny side. So we got some skinny t uh, Mickeys here. These are Sportsman's. These are 215 7015s up front. Look at that wheel well. Look how nice it's, it's all painted. You can see all the fasteners look like they're brand new. 
They've got all the boots in there installed. They look like they're all brand new. Look at the bottom side of that rocker. I'll tell you what, the bottom side of this rocker looks like they polished it. It looks as nice as the hood. You always want to look at the pinch weld too, where those two pieces of metal come together. That is a spot for the car to start um, rusting. So if you don't see any uh, swelling or anything there, you know you got a good solid body. Uh, 295, 55, 15's out back. Great looking Kragers. Again, the stance on this car is killer. And look at that wheel well there. Look at the shine inside there. Guys, you're gonna have to wax the inside of your wheel wells on this car. She is beautiful. And you can see the black paint right down to the bottom edge. This painter was not afraid to bend over for sure. Now let's get under the hood and check out the 383. All right, we're under the hood here. We got the 383 here. It's got those uh, Edelbrock uh, Performance RPM aluminum heads on it. It's got a Performer RPM intake on it also. Of course, a four barrel, but it is set up with a Sniper uh, Holly set up there. That's fuel injection, guys. You can see that the uh, headers are all polished up right up to the top. We got MSD distributor, and you know what? I, I said that the uh, balancer was MSD. More than likely, that's just a piece of um, timing tape on there that MSD sends with their kit. Um, we got the uh, alternators all polished up. We got a big set of aluminum um, uh, bracketry here. We also have a uh, set of uh, electric fans on the radiator. You can see that the power steering pump has got a uh, aluminum pulley and a chrome um, body to it. We do have manual brakes on the car, but this thing will stop on a dime. It's got the Edelbrock um, polished up valve covers on it. It looks like they even chromed up the uh, wiper uh, motor there. You can see all the wiring looks like it's brand new. Uh, and just everything about this car, the inner wheel houses are nice and clean. The firewall is nice and clean. They've used these really cool heat shrink um, clamps here on the hoses. I love those. Those are just like the heat shrink you put on your wire. You slip it on there, heat it up, and it clamps down the hose. Really nice, neat um, detail on there. I mean, everything under the hood of this thing is beautiful. Even the paint job on the bottom side, guys. Like I said, you're going to have to get some mirrors, you're going to have to open up the hood, and you're going to have to build some shelves in your garage for all the trophies and ribbons you're going to win with this baby. So give us a call at 248-974-9513 and let Vanguard Motor Sales Park this dream in your driveway.